Hello, my name is Terry Dean Nemers. On July 6, 2011, I went to the Pope County Sheriff's Department, I should say the lawless Pope County Sheriff's Department, to file a criminal complaint and film that same criminal complaint. Instead of allowing me to file my criminal complaint and film my criminal complaint, I was maliciously arrested for filing a criminal complaint and filming my criminal complaint. Now the important thing to notice or to note is that filing a criminal complaint is a legal activity in Minnesota and wherever you're at it's a legal activity. And in Minnesota it's a legal activity to film a criminal complaint. In fact I've done it before. In fact I've done it right across the street at the Glenwood Police Department. Of course the problem was that I was filing it against the lawless Pope County Sheriff's Department, or at least members of the Pope County Sheriff's Department at that time. So there's a definite uh, hatred for me by the law enforcement and supposed judicial system of Pope County. Obviously, they do not like me in Pope County because I have clear, precise, and unquestionable evidence that various elected officials and their minions are engaged in criminal activity. I have it all documented up on YouTube which is why they hate me because I'm not some person who runs around making these wild claims that I cannot prove. No, I can substantiate every single one of my assertions. That is why I am hated by the county officials in lawless Pope County, Minnesota. All right. I'm going to give you some contact numbers at the end of this video so you can contact the county attorney of Pope County and one of the county commissioners of Pope County, the one who represents my district. All right. I ask you to call them and ask them some embarrassing questions. In fact, I've actually provided you uh, uh, some embarrassing questions at the end of this video. Of course, they aren't going to want to answer that because they're going to be want to, they're going to want to invoke their right to remain silent because anything they say can and will be used against them in a court of law. Obviously, all right. So if you go to my website lionnews00.blogspot.com, you can see this flyer which explains why I'm being maliciously prosecuted by the Pope County officials. The Pope County officials, yes. And you can see why you should not believe anything in their police report. Of course, I have not placed their police report up there because part of my bail conditions that I'm not supposed to mention or uh, have other people contact the, the rogue officer that maliciously arrested me. All right. But the numbers that I've provided are for public officials. You can call them. And I'd ask you to call them, not making threats, not harassing them but to show your righteous indignation. All right. Ask them these embarrassing questions and when they refuse to answer them, you'll know darn well what the problem is. See, it's because I have clear, precise, and unquestionable evidence of local corruption and they do not like me exposing local corruption. That's why I'm a malicious prosecution victim. I have been victimized by these people before and if you check out the uh, criminal complaint that I filed with the police department which you'll find up on my website or at my YouTube channel Arrested Judge Kit you'll see the videotaped police report with the Glenwood police in fact it was the chief of police that took my complaint a little grumbling to begin with but after that there were no objections all right I had other witnesses there John Besser and Nikki Besser were there to witness this I feel that the reason that I was arrested, maliciously arrested on July 6th is because I was by myself. The only thing I had was God as my witness and my flip video camera. All right. At this point in time, my flip video camera is in the clutches of these people. All right. I'm representing myself in this case, so all evidence, which is the camera, should be in my possession or the film from the camera should be in my possession I do not have access to that film should be another question you should be asked the county attorney why am I not being provided with the evidence that proves that I am innocent 
Again, if you go back to my criminal complaint, you'll see why they do not want me to have my camera or my film from the evidence or from from the camera because it proves that I was not committing a crime. I was engaged in legal activities, filing a criminal complaint and filming that same criminal complaint. All right. So again, you can't trust what the Pope County Sheriff's Department or the Pope County Attorney's Office will tell you because they are professional liars. If I was making this stuff up, they could have easily charged me with making false statements to the police when I filed my criminal complaint back in uh, December 28th of 2010. All right, you'll see the, the criminal case number 20101745 up on my website. You can see the flyers, you know, with that number on there. All the pertinent information that you, that you need to contact these rogue officials and demand some answers. All right, so give them a call. Thank you for your time.